Take a decision in the presence of the Lord. Lord, you are greater than anything in my life, Lord. I may be facing the challenge that none of the worldly people has been facing. But even in that situation, we got to tell Lord how great thou art. It is so easy to tell during our happiness that God is great. But even in our sadness, even while we are going through troubles and tribulations, we got to tell how great thou art. My soul will sing how great thou art, Lord. Lord Jesus, then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee. How 
how great the world. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. How great the world. Oh, we praise you, Lord. Then sings my soul, my Savior God. How great the world, how great the world. The whole world is going through a struggle, the COVID situation, pandemic. Many people are struggling. Many are going through a difficult time where they do not know what to do. There are a set of people who have got stuck up back in India. At the same time, in many countries where they are not able to return to the place they want to be. The situation, many people are in, still in ventilator, not even able to breathe properly. There are people who cannot move their hands, who cannot talk, who cannot just say, Lord Jesus. But today, while we are in the presence of the Lord, let's thank God Hallelujah. for the wonderful health that He's given us. Hallelujah. Even during our healthier time, we are not taking time to praise our Lord Jesus. Then definitely, there's no other success in our life. So while we are in the presence of the Lord, make sure we give our best to the Lord. Hallelujah. There could be many appointments that we could have gone about instead of spending time in the presence of the Lord. But we took a decision to come into the presence of the Lord, to sit in the presence of the Lord, to praise Him. So while we are praising, yes, just Lord. give our best to the Lord. Hallelujah. As we are in the presence of the Lord, let's continue to pray for India. Especially the situation going there is so hard. Just because of COVID situations, the numbers are rising. They do not know what to do. Amen. There are still places where they need to be vaccinated. Still, the deficiency of vaccination is being prolonged. Let's pray that. Let God do a miracle and let this situation be a change. Yes. Hallelujah. Let's pray for this UAE. Let's pray for the rulers who have been behind, working hard 24 7 just to protect us. Hallelujah. Just we could pray for the authorities together. How many of you believe that today when we pray, God is going to do something new in our land? How many of you believe that God is going to do something new in our church? Hallelujah. Let's do not waste time. Let's be, let's completely be in a prayer attitude. I truly believe that Jesus is going to do something new today. Hallelujah. Look. When we go through the Bible, we could see when Jesus has done something new in any one of their life, they were expecting something from Jesus. They knew when Jesus is there, something new is going to happen. Yes. Likewise, when we believe that the presence of the Lord is there among us, we got to believe that something new is going to take place from our life. Just believe that something new is going to take place from our church. Let's believe that something new, something new. What's that new? Jesus is the only one. Jesus is the only God. Hallelujah. He's the same yesterday, today and forever. If there is any situation that we are going through that makes us sad, just tell him, situation, my Jesus is going to do something new. Hallelujah. Let's pray for India. Let's pray for UAE. Let's pray for the entire nation that God could do something new. Hallelujah. As we even get back from the sessions, hallelujah, we got to hear that God is delivering more people and people. Amen.